What's up, guys? I'm Zaf. I'm Rob. I'm Bryce. And this is Real Time. To come back at you with episode one, or episode 15, season one of The Vampire Diaries, A Few Good Men. Last episode um, was Fool Me Once. Obviously, Damon said that, but it was not really about Damon. It was about opening the tomb last episode, which we did get it opened, and we did get Anna's mom out of there. Catherine was not in there. Anna said she was last seen was it a few years ago or a couple she saw her in like 1982 or 1982 something. in uh chicago so that is very very interesting that means she's still alive unless she got staked or burned or something but that's bad for damon because now he knows that she's alive and she didn't really even look for him good for stefan because maybe damon goes out on a adventure to tr try to go find Catherine, but that is insane that she didn't even try to come see Stefan or Damon at like at all so it was a crazy last episode a lot of stuff happened uh the tomb got opened last episode it was a big big deal big thing with uh Bonnie and her grams pretty much she opened it they opened it but uh they didn't have have it so that vampires could come back out so she Gr grams was practically trapping uh any vampire who went in there in there so anna would have been trapped uh stefan would have been trapped or damon obviously then stefan went in knowing that to to get elena who could have came out but yeah pretty much we saw those bodies in there uh literally couldn't move just stuck on the ground but the one that we cared about, like Zuff said, wasn't in there, Catherine. So uh, that sucks, obviously, for them. But there was one person that got pulled out, and that is Pearl. We know Pearl is Anna's mother. She kind of was plotting this whole time just to go reunite with her mother. So that's dope. She got some blood, and she very, very quickly uh, is back to pretty much normal. We saw her in the hotel room, so uh yeah i don't know um she's probably gonna be a, a, a decently important character now with anna unless they just run away and off into the sunset but i think there's gonna be a lot more problems now because i think that the seal or whatever is is broken now on the the thing with the door being open yeah i mean we saw bonnie and her grams kind of go off last episode with the magic they're Pretty, I mean, they're the sole reason that uh, anything was accomplished with with that. But we did see that there were uh, repercussions or side effects, I guess, to using that powerful of magic. And last episode did end with Bonnie's Grams appearing to be dead. Um, Bonnie obviously found her in her room, was bawling her eyes out, had Elena come in, but... I mean, I think that that's like the biggest potential character death that we've had in the show so far. I mean, we've had a couple deaths, but for the most part, it's just like people that have come in for a couple episodes. Vicky. But Vicky. I guess Vicky. Yeah. Vicky is probably bigger, but I don't know. For some reason, I just think of Grams as a, a bigger character. I don't know. She's older. True. Made it longer. Um, at the very end of the episode, kind of gave us a little tease of what... The, uh, the other vampires down in the tomb were kind of up to. Damon did throw that bag of blood that he had intended for Catherine at the wall when he was all mad. So, I mean, we know that all that they need is a little bit of blood. And we saw one of the vampires got some, was obviously strong enough to start walking. And that's how the episode ended. So I think it is definitely important to not forget that Pearl was not the only vampire down there. There was there was a good bit. Yeah, it's like our videos. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, check out our links in the description. We got the page on the Discord and all of our social medias as well as our PO Box and second channel. And yeah, we're gonna go right into season one, episode fifteen of the Vampire Diaries. A few good men. Let's go. You seem like a very nice person. I'm still gonna have to eat you. <laughs> Sorry for what? For feeding on your flesh. It's all right, Harper. I'd do the same thing. And his outfit. His hair didn't grow at all for being in a tomb for so long. What the hell is this thing? <laughs> Pearson, classmate, best friend, so 
I binged it. So, I binged it. Let me bing that real quick. Is bing still a thing? Probably. Where's she at? Oh, which one? Left or right? Damon ate her, actually. Damon fed on her, mm. so she's dead. I think she might be alive in a vampire. True, he took her body, huh? Yeah. His wife was from around here. And her name was also Isabel. Wait. Wait. Did she just call Alaric Rick? What? <laughs> You're close, bro. What the hell? <laughs> He's going crazy. <laughs> Is he upset? So <laughs> much Who are these people? You're worried about me. That's nice. <laughs> Don't be. <laughs> just has four girls over. Just, just want to know if you remember anything about her. I was like a needle in a haystack. <laughs> Killed a lot of people. Shouldn't you do something a little bit more bachelor patty? What are you suggesting, you high schooler? <laughs> Stop, Matt. Yeah, good boy. Uh, <laughs> no, Matt, don't. What, are, what is the sex, ah. the sex police? Oh, what do you have against Caroline? Uh -huh. Whoa. Whoa. Hey. Well, that's mom? She's hot. <laughs> Reveal. <laughs> what the fuck? Yo! She really wanted a kiss there. She was like, please kiss me. I am totally gonna ruin this moment, but I have to tell you. I just farted. No. Adopted, and she's been looking for her birth mother, whose name is Isabel. That's such a bad time to do that. This is Elena's birth mother. What the? Which one? That's my Isabel. Uh, she, uh, she never told me. It's her. Yeah. You go. Yeah. I'm gonna go reevaluate my life. Trudy. Trudy? She's hot. Trudy Peter. Bro. Every girl you see here is hot. She's hot. hot. I think they all might be hot. They know how to cast. She had a baby that she gave up for adoption. Oh my god. God. You're her daughter. You're looking right at her. That's me. No, it's her. No, oh. that's me. Oh. Sure. Uh, it's me, Elena Gilbert. <laughs> you look me. a lot worse in person. Phineas, <laughs> in fub. Whoa, she was sketched there because... Did she invite her in? I don't know. But she was weird when she walked in. Yeah, I think Isabel might have been a vampire. And she's alive. Scholarship. Where did she go? Somewhere in North Carolina. Duke, I think. This lady's holding back information. She knows all this. I think it... Mm, was it Duke? Was it North or South Carolina? Hmm. <laughs> UNC, was it? Um, do I still talk to her all the time, probably? Yeah. Do I have a blackberry? Is that a blackberry? Mm -hmm. You got the goods? Something's come up. Jenna told you. Yeah. So Same dude, by the way. Your wife Isabel was Elena's birth mother. What Same dude, different font. <laughs> These two. About your wife, about everything about you. <laughs> Look at them, dude. <laughs> They're just the same person. Just like a 15 year age difference. He been stable. I'm telling you not to push this. Give me a reason not to. Help. You're surviving. How's that for <laughs> I'll handle it, but for now, I need you to let He it keeps go. playing around with these vamps, dude, like they won't just take his neck. I need something more than just your wife's name, picture, or something I could show Dave. I mean, that was just Matt's mom. Was it? Yeah.
Is it? Well, this is just a bad. This is not even the right actor. <laughs> what? They changed it? Yeah. But it, it like, wasn't. That it looks wasn't like, her in the in the picture. Looks like Ana de Armas. No. In the face, it does. No. Look. Uh -oh. She has her eyes. Ana de Armas is literally my wife. Well, you gotta admit she that. Does have the eyes. She has the look, right? The eyes. That is Maybe not Matt's mom. Virginia, near where I grew up. No, that's Isolated, not. But <laughs> you think she would look fucking drastic? That's Alaric. He looks the same. And they say that it's I just think they're casting someone for the past version. Maybe not. It has to be. Okay. I'll get my garlic and holy water. Dude, take it seriously. He's a vampire. No, he's not. How is he aged? Was this wasn't that long ago. Yeah. It was just like two years ago or something like that. Oh. Why are you trying to make her drink that? What in the Sam hell did you give her? What is this? Oh, it's just some herbal mixture. I'm not a vampire. No what? You didn't invite me in, and you're serving Vervain tea, you know. Oh. I think that you should probably leave. Wait. What are you not telling me? Please, leave. Uh-oh. Trudy sus. Trudy's just strange. She's probably went through some shit. Oh, Holy no. shit. Looks like a big bird. Oh, what is that stance? Where's the head at? Daddy? Dude. Why did you say daddy? He's protecting this house. Who the fuck was that? Here we go. The old. <laughs> a favor. I've been in love. <laughs> I've been so bent on someone. Just have your heart ripped out by. Married. Right. Gay husband. <laughs> Most eligible bachelors get raffled off for dates, and. Well, we're short of that. <laughs> Do when there's no um. Vampire. Organized bachelor raffles. Ha, oh, trust me. <laughs> they need a bachelor. There are vampires. Look, you're a hero to this town, Damon. I know most people don't know it, but you are. You're a hero, Damon. And I just, I just want to make sure that the high school did their homework on this guy. <laughs> sure, I can do that illegal thing for you. Oh, of course, Damon. Anything for the hero of the town. May I help you? Thank you for the text. Oh. You're welcome. I didn't tell her anything. He looks like one of the guys from Hot Shots Golf. Yes, you're done. She's dead. No, I won't invite you in. Can't come in. I'm not a vampire, so yes, I can. No, no. I don't understand. I did what you told me. I did my part. What Damn. the hell? Damn. What is going on? Trudy went down. Damn, oh, yeah, what? She's... How does that happen? Where's she been bleeding from? She didn't even hit her head. Where was the blood coming from? She literally landed on her ass. Elena, honey. Oh my god. Oh my god. Mom. Long time no see. <laughs> Maddie tells me you broke his heart. Mom. Just get him. Calm down. <laughs> he found his rebound girl. Damn, in front of her? Oh my god, that's crazy. Yeah, that is insane. Oh thing to say. my god. <laughs> oh my god. That is one of the most insane things I've ever heard. For a mom to talk about high schoolers. He found his rebound girl. Mm. Okay. I, I want them to definitely hit it off. Pardon me. Mrs. Lockwood. Oh, she wants them. I do. I want the. I. I want them to get together. 
she have a name? Yeah. Isabel. Isabel. Hmm. <laughs> yes, yeah. sir. Yeah. Yeah, L.A., New York. A couple years ago, I was in North Carolina oh. near the Duke campus. Oh. I think Alaric went to school there. Didn't you, Rick? Yeah, because I know your wife did. Oh, my God. I her once. She was she's a great girl. I heard tell you. She was she, delicious. Oh, he is such an asshole. Dude, that is fucking evil. That is crazy behavior. That's her mother, too. I just need some air. She just put two and two together, I think. Oh, oh my God. I'm sorry. I wanted to tell you, but I just... He said I had a drink with her. I was feeling... Drank her blood. Drank her blood. What the hell? Harper. No, it's the guy on the street. Do that fucking push Trudy down the stairs. Well, I ain't scared of him because he's on a vamp. Go talk to him. Then you're doing this nice thing. It's fake. Like you. Like you. Oh my god. Looks like she's drunk. Tell the lemmer boy I'll be at the bar. Looks like she's high. <laughs> and drunk. Whoa, easy. Oh, killed my mom. Killed my mom. Am I missing something here? Did I forget to mention earlier when we were talking about my birthday? Gave me up. Mm -hmm. Her name was Isabel. Oh. Go ahead. Reminisce about how you. Oh, he actually looks like he's upset now. You fucked up, Damon. Absolutely fucking fucked up. Let's get you home. I have a message for you. <laughs> Stop looking. Stop looking for what? She doesn't want to know you. She doesn't want to talk. Oh, she's alive. Do you understand? She's alive? Dude's an NPC. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you need to stop looking. Do you I have a quest. Yes, I do. do you accept? Good. There isn't much time. <laughs> Here, he's take this. compulsion, he said. Mm -hmm. uh, oh! That scared me. Oh, holy shit. That was insane. He said, I'm done now. Bus. Tid his head on the freaking pavement? Hello? Come on, skedaddle. Let's skedaddle. I mean, what's the point of this? You don't want kids. You're barely normal people. Maybe I don't want to. Maybe I don't want to. Maybe I don't want to, Paul. Or He wants to be a vampire. Oh. Are you really this stupid? <laughs> yeah. Guess so. Here for revenge. <laughs> Damn, dude. Alar, come on. I turned her. Why? She came to me. What the f Ooh. About her. And I liked her. Something special. Because you liked her. No, I slept with her because I liked her. Oh. oh. She begged me to. That's fucked up. I wasn't happy with you. Well, he stabbed him. Kindred spirit. Bitten by the women we love. Unrequited love sucks. Sounds like I got along. Which means I get to sit here and watch him. Oh my gosh. What was he doing? No. Not oh. Rick Saltz. I don't want him to die. <laughs> I feel like for some reason Damon's gonna turn him. I think he's dead. Yeah, it looks like it. Hey, less competition for you now, brother. For real. Jenna. She's getting way too close with her. Jenna? 
Almost cuff almost cuffed her. Needs a new bachelor. Whoa. You were dead, bro. That's something else. His ring? I don't. Yeah. Oh. What's up with the ring? Oh no. Oh, that's a giant piece of jewelry. I am. Is it just Vervain? Well, how would Ravain stop you from getting a hole in your lung? Yeah. That's impossible. What the hell is up with that thing? You got that, that wifey ring. That immortality ring. I can't believe that guy got macked. He said, I'm done. Backed up into a 18 wheeler. Was there a problem? Oh. Did you find her? What's going on? Isabel? Oh. Potential first talk with mom? Harper, where are you at? Is this Matt's house? No, it's this girl. Pearl! It's Harper. Ooh. Pearl. Hey, Pearl, you look good. I'm glad you found us. Miss Gibbons? This gentleman is a friend. <laughs> oh, shit, we got, we got squad. Any friend of Pearl's is a friend of mine. Squad deep in here. Please do. Come in. Hi, Anna. Well, a few good men, not a few good men at all. I feel like the only good man is Alaric. Um, I like him a lot. And we got, I mean, we got a lot about Isabel this episode. Uh, it was, I mean, she is definitely a vampire. She's alive. She just talked to uh, Elena on the phone. They, she uh, manipulated a man into telling Elena not to look for it and then killing himself, which he did. So that is just effed up. But yeah, Isabel is definitely a big figure right now. Damon is the one who turned her, I believe. And I think she was seeking out to be turned, or she was. She went to Damon and asked to be turned, and that is what happened. And she gave Alaric some sort of like a immortality ring like you said i don't even know what it is like it prevented him from dying like he got stabbed in a lung and i guess maybe it just healed him somehow it, that that's insane that is a very important ring i don't know what it is it's probably got to have more importance to it and like we'll learn more about it but that was a great episode it was nice learning about isabel and i'm hoping we find her soon and reunite everyone yeah i don't really know what was going on there with the whole trudy thing like she like someone in sh or I, the dude instructed her to specifically not invite in elena give her her vein pretty much just make sure she's not a vampire um and then killed her killed trudy after so like it seems like it, this is all isabel especially the fact that, that dude did just kill himself after doing his task so i don't know i mean i don't know how to feel about isabel in the flashback scene with alark she did seem like kind of like pretty sweet because she gave him that ring i feel like that ring the the only thing it reminds me of is maybe like the crystal that bonnie had because didn't bonnie get bit and then her her thing just healed immediately or something someone got bit before and it just instantly healed i think because she drank vampire blood yeah i'm looking forward to learning more about her it's just it is a crazy coincidence that his ex-wife is elena's mother and he had no clue that she even had kids or anything like she was definitely withholding a lot of information from him but obviously elena and them are not going to stop looking 
they're gonna keep trying to find her and yeah i don't know i'm i'm interested to see like why she did what she did and why she's being so weird about everything and not seeing her her ex-husband anymore yeah this episode we got to see the post catherine reveal damon and boy was he just at an all-time demon mode this episode just i feel like everything he was saying was just like a an attack at someone else um and uh yeah he he just he seemed like he had no remorse for his actions just doing whatever he wants and up until uh he found out elena told him that isabel is her mother like Zuff said he definitely looked upset by that news or like that that hit him somehow very glad to see that alark did not die obviously i knew that was gonna happen but uh yeah i um i didn't didn't remember exactly how it went down but uh did remember that alark's ring was special so glad that that has finally been revealed we did also get to see uh, a couple glimpses of of the man who we saw walking out of the tomb in the previous episode. His name is Harper, and uh, last thing that we saw here was him actually reuniting with Pearl Anna. Looks like there's a couple of other vampires there as well. They got themselves a little crew going right now, um, so I'm I'm excited to explore that more going forward if you guys like our videos make sure you like comment subscribe check out our links in the description on the patreon on the discord and all of our social medias as well as our PO box and second channel and yeah we'll catch you guys next time we're season one episode 16 of the vampire diaries peace out